wands. A wand usually represents a conducting wand in an orchestra, or a magician's wand. However, the wand shown in the images of tarot card, is described more similar to a staff, which people use to support themselves when they walk. That may be why the wands usually stand for the path or the itinerary. It usually stands for the tool that helps us move forward, instead of staying in the current situation. When we focus on the meaning of magician's wand, the wand is a tool that can make new things. It is a tool that creates anything that we have in our mind. It is a tool that can realize things that people have never imagined before. Thus, the wand usually symbolizes the passion and creativity. There are four elements that constitute the world, water, fire, earth, and air. The wand is usually related to fire. It may be simply because the fire can be started from the wood that composes the wand, and also because the fire is an important catalyst in a chemical reaction, which turns a certain material into a completely different one. The fire also represents the passion that pursues new and creative goals. The wand is a symbol that stands for an uncountable number of possibilities and strong will, but it is also used to warn us not to be too ambitious and not to hastily rush forward. Therefore, when you see a wand, you always need to remind yourself that you need to wait for a right time to carry out a new work, instead of running forward with your heart filled with your ambition. Cups A cup is a tool to hold water in. In addition, a cup can hold many different things that have no definite shape. That may be why the cup symbolizes many concepts that cannot be seen or touched. It usually represents the feeling and thoughts that we have in our mind such as joy, happiness, or sorrow. Also, a cup symbolizes the Holy Grail. A Holy Grail is a cup that we use to share wine. Therefore, the cup represents an interaction between people, empathy, love, and harmony. As a cup is a tool to hold water in, the cup represents water among the four elements. Since the water flows endlessly toward a lower place, its characteristic is similar to the flow of emotion between people. Not only does the cup symbolizes the emotion itself, but it also stands for the tool to provide concrete shape to invisible concepts. Therefore, the cup usually represents imagination and intuition. While the wand is a power that converts an existing object to a completely new material, the cup is a power that creates a new thing from nothing. In many cases, the cup is used to represent a warm and happy feeling, it is also a tool that can be easily hurt. It is used to warn us not to be too emotional and betray the reality. The power of compassion and harmony of the cup, gives us a great result in many cases, but we should keep in mind that if we only dream and stay in bed, we will not be able to accomplish anything. Swords A sword is similar to a wand in its use. As the wand is a tool to accomplish our hope and passion, the sword is a tool to express our will. It is different, however, in that while the wand changes a certain substance into a chemically different one, the sword symbolizes a physical reshaping of an object such as slicing and dicing. While the wand creates what we need, the sword often removes the obstacles in our path. While a wooden wand creates fire and a cup holds water, a sword turns an object into nothing. That may be why the sword corresponds to air among the four elements. Because a sword has strong power, the tarot card puts great importance in the mind of its bearer. Because it cannot be restored after the sword cuts an object, the one who wields it must decide precisely, based on clear facts and logic, before moving into action. To use the sword wisely, one needs high intelligence, determination, and moderation. We can find again that the tarot card always puts importance in balance and harmony, in that it emphasizes the power of the mind when you are given the tool of strong physical power. The sword in the tarot card is drawn as a two-sided sword. The sword can be very effective when it is used wisely, but it may also hurt many people when it is used carelessly. Therefore, many of the cards with swords warn us about the ill effects such as pain, theft, defeat, and regret. A great power comes with great responsibility. When you see a sword, think again how to act wisely, before thinking of what to abolish with it. Pentacles A pentacle is a star-shaped symbol with five tips. Traditionally, 
it is used in the magical circle that witches use to draw. Such a circle summons outer forces, and utilizes the power for our own good. You must have a base substance when you want to create something with the wand, but the pentacle provides the resources that we do not have. In most of the cases, the pentacles are drawn as yellow coins in tarot cards. A coin is a tool that we can buy what we need, or it is something that we gain after a hard work. While other symbols represent hope, emotion and will, this symbol stands for material compensation that we get as a result. It could mean the coin literally, or it can also symbolize mental abundance such as health or comfort. The pentacle corresponds to earth among the four elements. It is suitable, in that it is the only physical element that we can grasp, and the resourceful characteristic of a pentacle is related to the fact, that the earth provides an environment where all the others grow upon. The material abundance of pentacles provides us many things that we need to carry out a new project. We can create anything we want with the resources, but keep in mind that having the resources alone does not give what we need. We need to put effort to control, distribute and utilize the resources effectively. In addition, when you own many things, you will get more satisfaction by sharing it with others around you, instead of trying hard to keep it to yourself alone.